vector. A relative vector is the vector of a point with reference to another point. Or we can say the, you know, a, a relative vector is one vector right relative to another. Examples of relative vectors are A, B, C, D, E, F, and so on. So when we say relative vector, we can read relative vectors like this. Relative vectors are Relative vectors are read like this. The vector AB, for example, is the vector from A to B. Or we can call it, we can say it is the vector from A to B. Or, or we can say it is the vector of B from A. We can also say it is the vector of b relative you can say it is a vector of b relative to a <coughs> we can also call it the vector of b with reference we can say it is the vector of b with reference to a and so on so relative vectors uh, you know found like this Let's give some examples. Examples. Let's give some examples. Given, given the position vectors above. Given, using the position vectors above. Let's do it this way. Using, using the position using the position vectors given above. We are going to use the position vectors in the examples we gave on position vectors. So using the position vectors given above, find, find each of the following. Find each of the following vectors. That means we are going to look for each of the following relative vectors a b number two b a three c d four g a five a e six d Let's add a few more examples. That was six. Okay, seven. Seven. E. F. Hope I've not written E. F. Okay, I haven't. E. F. Eight. Eight. F. G. Eight. F. G. Nine. D. D A. Have I written D A before? No. D A. Let's <coughs> take a few more examples. D A. Let's do D G. Let's find the relative vector. Let's find the relative vector C G. Let's find. Let's find C F. Let's find uh, I just want to add as many examples I, as I can so that we can fully understand what relative vectors are. Let's find CF. Let's find EG. Can we find EG if we haven't already done that? Let's find EG. Let's try and find BG also. Let's find the relative vector B. G. I think that's okay. So let's take them one after the other. What is the relative vector A B? A B is the same thing as B minus A. The relative vector A B is the vector from 
a to b so to get our vector we always do b minus a so that means the relative vector a b is the vector o b minus o a the relative vector of a b the relative vector a b is the vector from b to a so let's say this is one and this is five we are saying that this length a b is five minus one which will give us four so relative vector a b for example you know we'll be gotten by doing vector b minus a so vector b stands for the position vector of b vector a stands for the position vector of what of a so a b is b minus a or o b minus o a that gives us what let's use the column vector to do it b is 3i plus 3j a is 3i plus 5j so 3i plus 3j minus 3i plus 5j so vector a b is 3 minus 3 then 3 minus 5 that gives us what 0 minus 2 i can leave it like this that my vector a b is 0 minus 2 or 0 i minus 2 j i can say vector a b is 0 i minus 2 j this can also be written simply as vector a b is equal to minus 2 j since 0 i means there's no i component let's go to the second example now if i'm to draw diagrams vector a b will be drawn from a to b like this vector a b will be drawn from a to b like this let me try and make it look geometrically correct <clears throat> this is vector a b you can see the reason it's not having i component now so it only goes vertical you understand it does not slant at all whether left or right so that's vector that's vector a b i'm sorry my arrow should be pointing downwards from a to b vector a b is the vector from a to b that's the relative vector of b to a next what's the number two we'll do number two next 